My mother is a wonderful woman. She's been the backbone of our family and really always available and has given up so much for my sisters and me and her family. My mother was diagnosed with lung cancer several years ago, I think about seven or eight years ago. And when we first found out about it, I felt, okay, here it is, it's our turn. And very luckily, uh, right when we found this out, my mother was able to see Dr. Einhorn, who uh, was very gracious. At the initial diagnosis, it was the, the results weren't good. Um, but we were very lucky. Um, and it was operable. So it's been a success story for us. Our family was incredibly lucky that my mother's cancer was treatable and curable. And my sisters and I wanted to do something in recognition of that and recognizing my parents' 60th anniversary. So we decided to make a gift to IU School of Medicine for an endowed chair for research allowing Dr. Einhorn to recruit and continue the wonderful work that they're doing towards curing all types of cancer. The Eskenazi family and it's the entire family have been wonderful to Indiana University and especially to the Cancer Center. Having an endowed chair is what every cancer center in the United States covets for their top-notch researchers. We already have a very excellent core of people working in cancer research here at Indiana University. The inducement of a funded endowed chair allows us to recruit the top physician scientists from other institutions to come to Indiana University and further our cancer mission. We don't rest on our past laurels or our present achievements. We want to look to the future and to make further advances. It is time consuming as well as financial uh, a drain to be able to do this type of research. Having an endowed chair is a major uh, incentive for recruitment and for retention. And I want to thank Sid and Lois Eskenazi, who I knew socially, minimally, before Lois was diagnosed with her cancer. And I want to thank their very bright and talented and philanthropic children uh, with David and his wife, Julie, Dory, and Sandy for carrying on the tradition of philanthropy that was instilled in them by their family, by their parents. Thank you is just too meager of a term, but I think you know the appreciation that I have for you as a family and God bless you.